Joining us right now is the band Genie. Well, I suppose we could call you the band, couldn't we? Hello, Aaron. How are you going? Hey, lovely to talk to you. I've always been a big fan, so it's nice to talk to you. Finally get to talk to you. Oh, that's very it's nice to have you on here on the Sunshine Coast. And all our listeners are saying a big cheerio to you. But we do need to know, who is Genie? Well, Genie consists of myself, really, and my band. We have a whole lot of guest acts that come in. We've had Olivia Filand. And our latest singles had the um, amazing Elise Simmons. And we've got a very new one coming up shortly, which I can't tell you about at the moment, Ooh. but um, that'll be out in a couple of weeks. <laughs> I was a little worried that you were the culprit at the bottom of the Jim Beam bottle that was causing Adam Harvey to do all the dirty things. But uh, <laughs> it's a different genie and spelt differently, but that's okay. Tell yes. us about the yes. name. It came out of a couple of things. My grandmother's name was Genie, and also it was one of my favourite cafes was called Genie. So um, it sort of came out of that. And what about your start in music? How did that come about? I've, look, I've always been playing since I was a little kid. Um, my dad played drums, then started guitar from a very early age. And so once I left high school, um, you know, I played in some bands and then started composing music for TV. Pretty much what I've been doing, so writing jingles and TV themes and writing on, for Lonely do, Planet. Do some name dropping for us, so people that might be able to uh, then put a name to the music. Yeah, so I've played in a Melbourne band called Speed Orange for a very long time. You know, I've recently done the Heinz Beans commercial. Um, I was a writer for Lonely Planet for about 10 years writing their music so lots of things so you've got a little bit of experience in the entertainment field then <laughs> just just a little bit yeah just a little bit we noticed you did a fair bit down at Tamworth this year what's your plan for the next 12 months well um, our next big gig um, especially for Queenslanders is we're playing at Broad Beach um, the country music festival up there which is really exciting so we've got three gigs up there uh, one on the Friday and two on the Saturday so that's going to be really exciting I just love Queen and so playing up there's going to be heaps of fun. Well, Aaron, it's been great to catch up with you tonight. We're going to give people a taste of Genie now. This is featuring Elise Simmons. The song's called This Cannot Be Love, and we're going to go out with that. But how can people get a hold of you? Uh, so we've got a Facebook page, uh, Genie the Band. That's probably the best bit. That's where we keep everything up to date. It's new singles, our new um, music video with Elise. Um, you can check that out on YouTube, which came out last week, which is lots of fun. It involves some um, very large stuffed animals, so check that out. <laughs> it's very weird. Um, yeah, and Facebook, and um, you know, you can find us on um, iTunes and YouTube and all, all the usual places. Too easy. You're all up to date. Well, here is Aaron. Thank you very much for joining us tonight. I'm sure we're going to catch you. up um, very soon. We'll catch up before Broad Beach because we just have to do things like that. But, oh, uh, awesome. and we want to get be great. and we want to get a bit of gossip when, you know like when next time you're on air we, we'll let you away this time but we want to right. we're going to get a bit of a scoop next time but until uh, I'll <laughs> give you some gossip that sure, sounds like a sure. good but, thing yeah thanks thanks for all your support really appreciate it anytime here they are right now Jeannie with this cannot be love featuring the beautiful Elise Simmons